Hi, I'm Sharon K. Richards, and I'm here today with Wayne Peterson. We are members of the team that brings you the voices of the community of spiritual masters and our off-earth allies on WeSeekToServe.com and ThoughtsFromAMaster.com. We are here today to bring through the voice of Lord Maitreya. But first, a little background. It may be quite obvious, but each of the masters and each of our off-earth allies speaks through many different voices into humanity, if not many, at least several. And there is a purpose for each voice, because each person who offers the voice has a background of unique experiences, has a background of unique education, and a unique vocabulary. And those who are speaking through us draw on that library of information. So there are some differences, and each voice is used for a slightly different purpose. And yet there is a consistency. There is a consistency in the message. There is certainly a consistency in the dedication of our spiritual masters and off-earth allies to be of service. So today, Wayne and I are each going to channel Maitreya. Now, Wayne has been working with Maitreya for 30 plus years and has written a lovely book about his experiences called Extraordinary Times, Extraordinary Beings. I, however, have been working with Maitreya for only about a year. So there is a difference and yet there will be a consistency in the message. We are here today and we're going to take off. Wayne, do you have anything to say before we start? No, I'm prepared, I believe. <laughs> At least I hope I am prepared. Yes, we do not know what he has in mind. He just said he wanted to talk. Uh, so this is going to be new. Um, right. Would you care to invite him in, please? I will indeed. Lord Maitreya, my friend Sharon is here with me. And we invite you in so that we may begin with anything you would like to say to our audience. All right, Wayne. Thank you. Yes, indeed, this is Lord Maitreya. And I wanted to say Sharon is my friend too, just as you are. When she started her work as being our voice, she did not know that she would eventually be a voice for me, whereas you knew from the start that you would be my voice. So that is perhaps a difference between you. But the essential message is that I do deliver the core truths through several different voices. And the use of several different voices enables me to have a nuanced view it is also a simply a matter of fact that there are various frequencies that resonate with different people. And that is another reason for using more than one voice, is that I find, and those of us who do maintain several voices find, that those we wish to reach will resonate more with one of our speakers, one of our voices, than with another voice. I am going to switch to Wayne. At this time, let me take a moment and present to you a brief outline of some of the things you can expect in this coming year, meaning 2013. It is a year where you will see 
more activity from this spiritual brotherhood who has worked behind the scenes for so many years and such a long, long period in which we have not worked directly with humanity. Now, however, it is time for us to be more bold and step out into the eye of the public. And that is exactly what we intend to do. It will not be long before many of you will indeed see us and know us and we will no longer hide from the public eye. A few of us at first will come forward and as time passes more and more of the spiritual brotherhood will step forward into the dense physical world of humanity. I can promise you that there are great events that will take place that will thrill many of you because we are taking care to guide those who wish to work with us into creating a new and better and more spiritual civilization on this planet. We invite you all to work in harmony with us. We cannot do this alone. It is not even allowed for us to do this alone. It is humanity that must do the work. It is humanity that much must make the decisions. We can only point you in the right direction. Nevertheless, we are certain that we will be successful in this joint effort between the spiritual brotherhood and humanity. I would also like to thank those who have already for many years recognized me for who I am and have struggled to get out the message that I and the other members of our spiritual brotherhood are in fact here. This is no small task for many doubt that we even exist. But I can tell you, we do exist and soon it will be difficult for anyone to deny that we are here and that we have only the best intentions on creating a new civilization that will be appreciated by all. We do not shrink from this task, although many changes will take place in a rapid sequence from now on. Do not be afraid, have no fear, because we stand by to protect you as you take on new tasks. 
we have help from many places and many sources who have come at this time to lead us into a new world that many already expect is coming. So be of goodwill, stay positive, and all will be well. I thank you for listening to this message and look for me very soon. Thank you. And I return to speak through Sharon. Those of you who have been following we seek to serve.com and thoughts from a master.com can clearly identify the consistency of message. And this message has been consistent throughout these two websites. Before the team was formed that brings you these voices now, the message was coming through. But you see, Wayne and I have been working together a very long time. And we needed to form a team to make him comfortable coming out and speaking in public. And that is exactly what we did. And the message is consistent. So Wayne, I would say thank you very much for coming forth and speaking publicly. That is the end of this message. I hope that you have found it useful and informative. I thank you. Thank you.